The war in Ukraine started in 2014 when Ukrainian fascists were killing Russian civilians. These words were spoken by Robert Fico during Slovakia's electoral campaign. His party, Smer, has just won the parliamentary election. This casts doubt on whether Slovakia will continue to support Ukraine or take the same road as Hungary. And how will the Slovak judiciary be affected by Smer's victory? OSW analyst Dr. Krzysztof Dembiec discusses the election results and what will happen next. Robert Fico's uh, Smer Social Democracy won parliamentary election in Slovakia and will be most probably the cornerstone of the future ruling coalition. The party of uh, former uh, triple prime minister won almost a quarter of the vote. It was uh, especially popular in uh, rural areas outside of the biggest cities, although it came second after progressive Slovakia in the two biggest cities of Bratislava and Kosice. Probable FICO government uh, will most probably restrict uh, the support for Ukraine. Slovakia is currently among the biggest uh, donors of any aid uh, to Ukraine in relation to GDP. Mm, according to Kiel Institute, it's uh, number six in the world. FICO is announcing uh, that he will not se- send a single bullet to Ukraine. He is, however, more hesitant when it comes to business military contracts. Um, and uh, Slovakia is actually uh, delivering uh, self-propelled howitzers on such bases to Ukraine. It's also uncertain uh, how FICO will fare in relation to Brussels and Washington. He's saying uh, he will be more sovereign in his stance and he will be able to say no when the national interests of Slovakia requires that. However, during his previous time in office, FICO uh, showed he can be a pragmatist and he was able to differentiate um, his rhetoric directed towards domestic electorate, which was always more harsh and uh, uh, more radical. And on the other hand, um, he actually never made a controversial big decision um, when it comes to relations with the West. He always said yes to subsequent uh, sanctions towards Russia. He was also the face of uh, military uh, contract with the US, uh, which was the biggest uh, modernization of Slovak uh, army in its history. Mm, The first uh, of uh, 14 uh, F-16 fighter jets should come next year during probable FICO government. And actually, even after criticizing uh, Brussels' stance uh, towards uh, mag- migration issues during uh, its peak uh, crisis in 2015-16, FICO ultimately acquired uh, the minimum numbers of refugees required not to enter into a dispute uh, with the European Commission contrary to his uh, Visegrad for partners. It seems like uh, Viktor Orban is a role model for Robert Fico in a way and uh, Fico is announcing that uh, he will be his policies will uh, be similar to that uh, that are implemented uh, by Budapest uh, administration and both domestically and um, in terms of foreign or European policy and uh, we should uh, expect that when it comes to domestic policy, he will surely come closer to that and uh, some disputes regarding uh, rule of law issues can be expected. On the other hand, uh, FICO uh, has never had a major dispute with Brussels or Berlin or Paris and uh, he's uh, now presenting himself, for example, as a a proponent of um, the idea of strategic autonomy that is uh, uh, advocated by um, uh, President Macron in France. So he'll probably want to calm down the emotions around uh, the parliamentary elections that uh, have been evoked by 
alarming media articles uh, around the world.